if um, a parent either suspects that their child may have an eating disorder or knows and they're maybe going to have the conversation that they want to take their child in for treatment, what, what should they do? What should they say? Well, first of all, don't be confrontational. The child is probably going to deny it, um, may become very angry, very upset about it. Um, and what the parent can do is, is just sit down with them and say something like, I know that you want to be healthy, you want healthy eating, healthy um, weight loss, healthy exercise, but I think you've carried it over a little bit too far. Why don't we just go in and see your provider and see if he or she agrees with us? And then if they can call the provider and give them a heads up and say, this is what my concerns are, then they can get an appointment um, of a little bit longer, maybe a little bit longer, so that they can have more time to spend with the, with the uh, person. Don't start weighing that child. That's the worst thing in the world. Get rid of that scale. <clears throat> um, that when they get into the doctor's office, the, um, the, they will be weighed, but get rid of that scale at home. Um, and if they can start doing family meals with the child, mm -hmm. that's very important. Um, very often these kids are very adept at saying, oh, I, I ate over at, at Sammy's house, or I ate at school, and, just, and they are not eating. So if they can sit down and have family meals with them, they're very helpful. <clears throat> but encourage them not to start dictating to the child what they should eat or how much they should eat. Don't get into battles at the meal. Just start them with the family meals. Let the provider be the, the heavy on that. Because they'll say, well, you have to eat this, you have to eat that. Um, but don't get into battle with the parents.